Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi ta'ala wabarakatuh um, I am here with brother Esam And I'm going to show how we can How we can um, Modify this page uh, For the branding of news group And for the branding of Esteem College Okay. We have two portals uh, on the website uh, on the internet. One is portalnewslearningcenter.com. Okay, you can spell it as C E N T R E here, or you can spell it as C E N T E R. It does not matter. I have registered both the names. Why is it not coming? Out? Let other people learn as well. So it must be spelled yeah, as uh, to make it the R E. Now, you want to change the logo and you want to change the uh, banners, pictures, and things over here. I'm going to log out of my account and I'm going to log in as Brother Esam at the moment I still know his password which is the name of his girlfriend <laughs> and I can still get the same screen as uh, I have because Brother Esam is also a administrator. So, if you go to site administration on the administrator session panel here, you see we have this panel over here. Well, we have this panel here, administration. So, uh, click on. If we record this, we can have a look at what we do. Okay. So, we go to site administration. You want to stop? No, that's a different one. Uh -huh. okay. Site administration. Can you see this? Okay. Go to appearance. All right. There are a lot of things here. If you are an administrator, don't simply delete the things here. It's not easy to set them up back. Okay. It's going to take like one month to set everything all back. Appearance. Go to teams. All right. Team selector allows you to change to a different team. We are using this team now called Lambda. This is the one that we are using. But there are a few other teams here as well. Okay. We don't need to change this team because um, <laughs> it's going to upset <laughs> a lot of things. Yeah, everything will go. So, go back to site administration. Go back to appearance. Go to team setting. I have my. You can you can uh, adjust a few a few uh, factors on the team setting here, and you can also go to team lambda. Come on, I want to show you the things that you have to do. So if you click on Team Landa, there are a few menu items that you have to handle in order to change everything. Okay. Now, generally, you want to put a logo here. This is the current logo. So, brother, can you put your logo over here? <laughs> sure. 
Yeah. Yeah. Change the logo to your logo. Yeah. There are two logos that you have to do. One is Muse Group and the other one is uh, uh, Aston College. The home button here, you can choose where to point to. You can also change the page width. I suggest that you don't change any of these. Please change the logo. Alright? Please change the logo. Here you can change the page background. I have a few backgrounds that you can change. You can change the colors of the theme. You can see right now we are using red as the color but you can change to different colors for different things your social media URL the fonts that you want to use why don't you use the elemental? huh? elemental 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 huh? Okay, so this is for the slideshow. The slideshow is this one. The slideshow is is uh, this slideshow here. The first slide we change this to something else. You can put heading, you can put caption and you can put a URL if people click on the slide, it will go to that URL The second slide is this picture You see how it works out Let's look at the second slide So this second slide has a heading and has some writing and if you click over here, it goes somewhere So what? how to do that is by putting the heading putting the writing and putting the URL the third slide fourth slide maximum you have is five slides so think of what you want to put over here and uh, change the slides eh? so this is where you change this particular area can you do this bro based on the video now we also have something here called the carousel this is the carousel okay the carousel allows you to highlight the, uh, four different uh, uh, important courses like that when, when people click on it it will take to the course so where do you do that you do that over here you do that in the carousel area okay you can put the carousel at the top of the page or the bottom of the page you can put a heading for the carousel the heading will come up here before the carousel the heading will come, come up on top of the carousel this is the heading right and these are the how many slides that you want to put in you can put in so many on the cursor you can put in so many on the cursor so cursor number one this is number four no, so I've got four here number one the heading the writing number two number three number four because I'm using four items for the cursor so that is where you change this cursor okay where do you put this one by the side of the cursor you go over here this one here this HTML right Now the next one that you have below the cursor 
Ah, uh, this thing. This is for the login. Where is the login? The login is the one right on top of the page. This one here is the login area. So your setting over here changes the login. Now if you come in as so that's how you set the team. If you come in as an administrator like Esam has done here. You will see this panel. Not everybody will see this panel. Only administrators will see this panel. Just now we expanded this one in order to do the team. Look at this. You can turn editing on. Right? Turn that editing on. Will allow you to change a few things here on this page. You see this thing here? There is an edit button here. Why do you have this edit button? Because you have turned the editing on. If you turn it off again, you will not see this edit button anymore. So if you edit this, you can change this thing. Okay? You you know how to do this, bro? Yeah. Just go to edit, edit setting. Okay. 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 Then you put your writing over here. This is where you put your writing, and how will it come out? It comes out like that. You have to write some HTML over here, and you can add more things over here. You can add activities or resources. What are activities? You can put a quiz. You can put a forum. A lot of things has been added to this portal. Okay, it's not a normal uh, out of the box uh, Moodle. This has already been enhanced with a lot of things. So you can try to put any of these over there. Okay, you can put journal. You can put a lesson. You can put a millionaire game. You can put questionnaire, book reader. So many things that you can put over there. You can also put resources, you can put books, you can put files, you can put folders, you can put web page, and you can point to a URL that points to somewhere else. So how do you do that? You choose what you want to add, okay? By clicking on this one, add activity or resources. How do you do this? You go back to here and you turn the editing on or off as an administrator. How about this? This is the same thing. Okay, this is an activity that has been added using this. Yeah. So by adding this activity, I get that. All these things. Okay. So, uh, the other thing that you can change on this page is you go to this administrator's panel and you click on edit settings. Welcome to get a mark skill learning portal. A number of our courses. Where does that appear? Oh, this one has been hidden from here. This is the front page summary. So on the front page, the first thing we want to show is the cost search box. Where is the cost search box? This is the cost search box. And then we want to show announcements. Where is the announcements? These are all announcements. Okay. So this area here 
This area here is uh, what an unregistered uh, person visiting the website will see. But after you have logged in, this is what you see in here. So as some has not enrolled into any courses, he does not see a lot of courses. Okay. But if we were to uh, I say go in as my password. You see a lot of courses here. Why do you see a lot of courses? Because this my courses section, enroll courses, has a lot of courses in it. Followed by announcement. And I can add on. I can put on more things, more things, more things, more things. Okay, I can put up, for example, a list of courses. So right now, if we go down here, this is my course the courses that I have enrolled in and end of the page I have news now I don't want to have news in between news and this I want to have a list of courses so what I do is I'll say I put up list of courses over here and I put down the announcement right at the bottom of the page ok and this one shows uh, how many Category, uh, uh, child categories uh, that we show so let's say I want to show two categories by default yeah. and how many courses to show there are quite a few things that you can set over here I'll save the changes And when I refresh this, list of categories will list the categories instead of the courses so what's the difference between list of categories and courses list of categories shows a structure shows a structure rather than uh, a list of courses now you can see list of courses without any structure but list of categories will show Some of these courses have been um, so this in this and then this is where on the side of station sometimes it's over here sometimes it's over there it's just the same menu we can manage courses and categories over here. You can see all these courses and categories. You can see whether this is uh, hidden or this is displayed. This hides this category. This one opens the category. Subcategories. See a lot of categories are hidden. So we can unhide them like that and hide 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 that.
Ну, а я сегодня. Take me to the. I don't have any position there yet. Mm -hmm. I only have to get to here. So, for example, I have to go to this one. So I have all these buses. So, these are the subjects. There's no content yet in the subject. So, you can put in the content. Okay, so please um, edit these two websites. Please edit these two websites, this one and this one. According to UK. So, portal.newslearning.com newslearningcenter.com All the cross categories. Okay, edit them as uh, you require. Okay, thank you very much.